Hi folks, Mike here at Sawney View Memorial Garden in our town of Cumming, Georgia. And we're here to visit the final resting place of a beloved local celebrity. I'm gonna start my journey to where I've been told this resting place is from the mausoleum here at Sawney View. We're going to head into the Garden of Devotion toward this big cross that you can't miss when you come in. I'm not going to be able to linger here very long because it appears that preparations are being made for at least three different interments today. And cemetery roads, they're narrow. There's not a lot of parking. I'll have to make myself scarce pretty soon. So after you strolled past the big cross from the mausoleum, now as we near the corner and right off the sidewalk, We're going to go to the second grave over where we'll find the final resting place of Mr. Junior Samples of Hee Hall fame. I think pretty much everyone of my generation has some memory of the television show Hee Haw. For my family, it was a Saturday night ritual. Every Saturday night, it started with Hee Haw it often ended with Carol Burnett, and then it was off to bed to get ready for church the following morning. The cast members of Hee Haw were people we believe we knew. They were all too close, sometimes caricatures of folks that we knew every day in our lives. But even back then, to my family, our favorite was Junior Samples. Sawney View is a pretty little cemetery surrounded by woods, and in fact, it sits on this little lake. Earlier I saw families out here fishing. And perhaps there is no more fitting a final resting place for our local celebrity than right here by this lake where people come to fish because he was well known as an avid fisherman. In fact, that's how he got his start in show business. Show business success came fairly late in life to Junior. An avid fisherman, locals were used to his, his tall tales about his whoppers that he would bring out of the Lake Lanier and nearby waterways. Junior ended up telling one of these tall tales on one of the local radio stations and, and that bit became so popular that a novelty record was made and it sold a lot of copies producers of Hee Haw caught wind of Junior and 
his tall tails and they figured he was the kind of personality they wanted on Hee Haw. By all accounts, Junior never lost his sense of humility and of who he really was, despite the celebrity. And he was still fond of telling big fish stories for free, despite the fact that he now could fetch top dollar for it. Those of us who remember Junior remember that he was a large man and he passed away at the all too early age of 57 from a heart attack. I'm 58. One of Junior's most popular bits from Hee Haw had to do with being a used car salesman selling junk cars at a lot whose phone number was easy to remember. It was BR549, and BR549 has become part of the lexicon, at least here in the United States. But how many of you know where BR549 actually came from? Now, you're not gonna find this on any Google searches. This is just a bit of local lore. But folks here about believe this with all their hearts. So let's go say goodbye one last time to Junior, and then I'm gonna take you for a little ride and show you why locals believe they know where BR549 came from and why it really, knowing Junior, makes a lot of sense. Now, I'm a fisherman too. I don't think you can live near Lake Lanier and not put a line in the water at least every now and then. So as a fellow fisherman and as a fan of Mr. Samples and of Hee Haw, I'm going to leave this little tribute. He was a especially fond of bass fishing. I'm going to leave this little lure as a tribute and as a way of saying thank you. Folks, we are about to turn onto Bald Ridge Marina Road, formerly just Bald Ridge Road. And interestingly enough, my neighborhood is right off of Bald Ridge Marina Road. That's right, Bald Ridge Marina Road actually ends at Lake Lanier, one of Junior Samples favorite places to fish. Some folks say that 549 is one of the slip numbers. Some folks say it's one of the many boat ramps that people put their boats into the water. But one way or another, Bald Ridge Marina Road ends at the lake. Would it be strange to think that BR stands for Bald Ridge? So does BR 549 point us down Bald Ridge Road to the lake where this avid fisherman was wont to go? Well, the locals seem to think so. Thank you so much for joining me for this tribute to the late great country comedian and star of Hee Haw, Junior Samples. Until the next time, this is Mike saying bye.